resources, efficiency and cleaner production in the Pangasius industry. Having the advantage of a high nutritious value, competitive prices and an adaptability to different global preferences, Vietnam's Pangasius products currently account for 80% of the global market. Pangasius production and processing plays an important role in Vietnam's economic development, especially in the region of the Mekong River Delta. However, after the rapid growth from 2008 onwards, Vietnam's Pangasius industry has been confronted with varying environmental and market-based difficulties, leading to a slowing down of the export sector and an increase of fluctuations in the process. According to a report by the Vietnam Association of Seafood Exporters and Producers, VASEP, in the Mekong River Delta, there are 136 Pangasius exporting companies, including 64 processing companies and 72 commercial ones. One of the major issues facing Vietnam's Pangasius enterprises is inefficient resource consumption, leading to high raw materials loss and increases in production costs. I think the Vietnam Pangasius sector is facing many challenges due to increasing production costs, for example, electricity costs. It is highly desirable for enterprises to reduce costs in order to increase their competitiveness in the global market. To reduce production costs and enhance the competitiveness, the Establishing a Sustainable Pangasius Supply Chain in Vietnam Super project has implemented the consultancy and training programs on resources efficient and cleaner production RECP, for enterprises in the Pangasius supply chain in Vietnam. Resource efficiency and cleaner production is the most important factor for the sustainable development of the industry. Therefore, we apply this method to solve a practical problem, which is how to improve the competitiveness of Vietnam Pangasius industry. The implementation of RECP methods at the enterprise include three main activities. Activity 1. RECP training. The VNC PC experts delivered the training for the company's technical staff on RECP concepts, methodology and practical knowledge. Activity 2. In-plant RECP assessment. Investing the production processes and low efficient resource areas within each process step, raw materials, electricity and water, by measurement and monitoring. Activity 3. RECP evaluation and sustainability in the company. Selected RECP solutions are implemented to reduce resource consumption focusing on energy and water. The super project includes one important component, which is the resource efficient and cleaner production program. We have already implemented this assessment program for two years, and so far we have completed it with 40 fillet companies. This program shows good results and participating companies can save costs on electricity and water, which are the main costs in the Pangasius production. Energy efficiency. Option 1. Improving industrial maintenance to optimise energy efficiency of equipment includes maintenance of electrical systems, maintenance of refrigeration systems. Option 2 good housekeeping and better process control. During the operation and maintenance, air mixed with the refrigerant can cause energy loss. Energy loss at refrigeration system including IQF. Energy loss at cold storage. Inappropriately closing doors to cold areas can cause energy loss by 5 to 10% of total energy consumption. Water consumption. In fish processing, water is lost due to wasteful practices by workers, water leakage and broken piping. The implementation of RECP methods have the potential to bring considerable technical, economic and environmental benefits, which assist enterprises to reduce production costs and grow sustainability. By adopting RECP options, the following results could be achieved. 1. Schedule maintenance on electrical system, better voltage control. 2. Install capacitors, reallocate capacitors. 3. Buy electricity with high voltage. 4. 
Optimise the running of cold stores. Close the doors to cold areas. 5. Descale the condenser. Improve maintenance on refrigeration systems. 6. Install heat pump water heater using solar energy. 7. Repair water leakage. Optimise water consumption. During the project implementation, the first results at fish processing companies are quite positive. Since Acom Fish Company participated in resources efficient and cleaner production program of the super project, we have achieved the benefits from reduction in production costs, specifically reduction in energy consumption by 7 to 8 per cent equivalent to 1 billion VND, saving water by 5 to 6 per cent, equivalent to 50 million VND a year. The company has already applied RECP solutions for one year, delivering good results, and the trend shows a significant decline in energy consumption. Especially, it is shown clearly in electricity cost reduction. Taking advantages of RECP options will assist enterprises in financial savings, improving profitability, partially solving their financial problems and enhance sustainability to Vietnam Pangasius products in the market.